YouTube, Kenneth, the Rhino. We are drinking a beer from Japan, which is 5% alcohol. It is, what's that say, Natachi Nest? Hitachi no, Hitachi no Nest? Yeah. It's a white ale from Japan from the Kiyuchi Brewery. Me and Boychuk actually drank one of these. We drank the ginger ale. Um, it has a happy owl on it. Yeah, it has a very happy kid's owl on it. Ingredients? Water, malt, hops, um, and coriander and orange juice. A pureed owl. There, it doesn't say anything on here about wheat. It's supposed to be a wheat ale. Anyway, this white ale is brewed with wheat malt. Okay, it's wheat malt. And flavored with coriander, orange peel, and nutmeg. Please enjoy the soft and flavorful taste. Well, it doesn't say anything about orange peel or nutmeg on the ingredients. What is what is wheat? It's probably malt? spices. I don't know what wheat and malt is. I'm used to wheat being put in here, not wheat malt. So maybe something missed in the translation. Well, you're like the beer connoisseur. I'm just a thug who smashes shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, smashy thug. <laughs> Thugs, it's our company, man. Back when we were in university, totally helpful undergrads. <laughs> we do moving, and we like do laundry, and we do gardening. Thugs. And then we smash skulls. <laughs> that was a pretty good marketing ploy, personally. There you go. Oh, it's a small bottle, so we both get a little bit. Very straw, pale yellowish color. A little bit of head. I got a lot of head. Yeah, well, you just poured it right in. Yeah. Oh, it says there's orange juice in it. Yeah, but then when you read the description, it talks about orange peel. Well, there's a lot of Japanese and Korean and Chinese on this. Clearly, there's some well, English, nice English maybe, situations going maybe on. Maybe something here. was lost in translation. <laughs> That's how the English works. English. English equals fail. I do some chat, so. Yeah, I'm fine with that. <laughs> I want a shot too. <laughs> well, we'll bring you one. What are you shooting? Uh, I'm the vodka. vodka. Polish vodka. <laughs> Look, the happy owl. Check it out. Happy it doesn't owl. smell very good at all. Do that thing a sniff. No, it smells sort of like. Any beer? Sort of, but like not. Rickards does like the most horrible white beer ever known to man, but it's just me. I've um, been trying to rip off Hogarden personally. It has some orange peel on it. It has some coriander on it. I don't get any nutmeg. I don't. It just. It doesn't smell good. It doesn't look like a wheat beer. It had. Well, yeah, it looks like the wheat beer. It isn't filtered or anything. It has some hops on it. It has that bitterness at the background, so it smells more like a beer with, like a normal beer, not a wheat beer, with coriander and orange peel added to it. Well, let's try it. <laughs> That's actually not a bad wheat beer. <laughs> <laughs> what was on my head? A uh, beer bottle. Penis. <laughs> it was a big black feel though. <laughs> I love how we're getting drunker and drunker and still doing these. That makes it better. The internet will love us. It's a good beer. I like it. See, I don't really like it. Well, you don't like wheat beers. You've already said I love that. wheat beers. Uh, okay. Sure. Porters, stouts, and wheats are my favorite. But this, this just doesn't... I like the happy owl. Yeah, there's a beer I had in Poland, it was like, it looked like this. It looked, it like I really like this stuff, it's good. It's fucked up. I enjoy Holgarten, and this is pretty close yeah. to it. In yeah, fact, I think it's even... It does taste like a wheat beer, you're right, it just... Some kind of meat. Is that bad? <laughs> I have something that tastes like meat. <laughs> it just has more bitterness and more real beer taste than it should. I mean, it's a good try. I'll give it that. It's a great attempt. I mean, I don't think Japan Japanese people make many white beers. 
I don't think they've ever, I've never seen any. Neither have I. So, I mean, I give it that it's, it's better than a lot of the beers you can get in Canada. They, they don't have wheat fields, right? They're all trampled in the ground by a samurai riding a horse and Godzilla chasing them, right? So. I hope that was caught on the camera. Oh. Uh, so, I have to, uh, Commander Jumper, Jesse Yell, she'll take cock over coffee at all times. The taste. <laughs> the taste. <laughs> that was her taste. And she'll take the taste of cock. Well washed or like a day old? <laughs> Sweaty day. Day old. 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 I'm giving it a 6.5. I'm giving it a 9. I like it. 6.5 from me and 9 from from Kenneth. Thank you for watching the Albino Rhino beer review. I drink it again. It's just not great. I'm totally Ken thinks it's great. I'm like, case this shit. So thank you for watching the Albino Rhino beer review. Good beer drink it is. Bye. <laughs> We've already determined that Karina's a good girl anyway, so... I am. But she likes the taste of cow. Yeah, I am, I am. Good girl. I am quite good. Single pigeons. We can change that. Gang rape. Oh, what a nine out of ten. Edit point. Gang rape. Maybe still recording. That's a good point right there. I'm already gonna rape Jesus. <laughs> <laughs>